Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, sorry, tired, <laughs> ladies and gents, I got somebody I want to play for y'all. I haven't played this young lady ever on my channel. And I am sorry about that. Selena! Ladies and gentlemen, let me explain. Selena grew up amongst Jehovah's Witnesses, and I knew her cousin. He went to my Kingdom Hall, and I remember when she died and how it affected him. And literally, I've listened to Miss Selena a lot, but I haven't played her one time on a single video. And if I did, it was unknowingly, because I definitely would have said something about this young lady. I know, I know. Ladies and gentlemen, some of you are overstepping your bounds. You're communicating with me by email about my videos. I've already blocked one person because I specifically said not to do something, and apparently they, they're God, and they can do whatever they want. So they won't be doing it with me. That goes for the rest of you. I don't want you commenting about my videos through email. The email is not for that. So stop it. I'm not going to say it again. There's no reason for me to keep repeating the same thing over and over again. Because I don't appreciate having to repeat the same thing over and over again. It's really irritating. Uh, then you just repeat this. Shut up. Sorry. I do want to give you guys a heads up. This document has been edited, top to bottom. I used ChatGPT to edit it, okay? And went through every word, listened to every bit of it, and I'm still proud of this document. Now, the problem is, we could have held it for our people, but we didn't. We decided to give it to all of you at the exact same time. Well, because we know many of you are not going to use it. <laughs> many of you, oh, I just want the document. I just need another document in my profile. No, let me put it in. Okay, it goes in that file right there. So I'm just going to keep it right there, and I'm going to wait. I just, no, nah, no, I'm just going to wait. That's what most of you do. So in total, with this particular document, six hours in total from beginning to end, the new document is up. All I had to do was just upload it. It goes right back to the same spot. I've already downloaded it, and I've confirmed that it's the same. I, 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 I It jumped all the way over there. I apologize. It's the exact same document. Okay, so I uploaded it. It has all of the amendments, including adding this case. No, not that case. This case right here, Mullane versus Hoover Bank and Trust Company, where the Supreme Court says you had a right to notice. Okay, so the document is up. The link will be in this video as well. And I'm getting ready to put up a video I did this morning talking about this. So there you go. Ladies and gentlemen, I thank you, Celine. Celine is going to take us out of here, ladies and gentlemen. This video is going to be short. I just had a young lady who has been a sap packer from the beginning. She said that somebody misled her, lied to her, told her something wrong. Let me make sure everybody understands. People receive legitimately especially our sat pack winners, at least a million dollars worth of credits. Hold on. Just because y'all didn't do your research and see how valuable credits are that you could sell them, trade them, or use them to offset debt or offset your cousin's debt with the so-called child support department is not our fault. Don't blame us for that because we did exactly what we said we were going to do. Now, you go ahead and see if anybody else is going to give you for a couple of hundred dollars, a couple of thousand dollars worth of tax credits, worth, which equates to a dollar for dollar, dollar for dollar. I'm going to play Celine one more time before we get out of here. I don't know what to say, people. See, in people's minds, and I can't help that. It wasn't my job to go and say, oh, where are you getting that book? From. Nobody said this is going to sit up here and get you out of the system. 
We never promised to take people out of the system. Have I not consistently said it's too late to get out of the system? Have you not heard me say that repeatedly? They're not letting people get out of the system. I don't care what video you're listening to. There is no mass exodus. They are not allowing it. This is not the Matrix, the movie. This is the Matrix reality. The document that we just put together, I need to show y'all something, okay? I really did need this song right now. Ladies and gentlemen, I want y'all to pay attention to something. I I forgot this was even in here. Look, the new money will be worth 100 cents, okay? Every dollar of this new money will be worth 100 cents. So please understand. Let's find out about what's going on here. I promise you I can prove that this whole thing was illegal. We're going to take this section right here. No, we're going to take both this section right here. This is the opposition to the concentration. Oh, that's right. It won't let me do that. So we're just going to read it. Mr. Speaker, today the chief executive sent the president to this House of Representatives a banking bill. Let's go ahead and make this so all of y'all can see what, 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 what he and I are talking about. For immediate enactment, the author of this bill seems to be unnamed. No one has told us who drafted the bill. There appears to be a printed copy on the speaker's desk, but no printed copies are available for House members. The bill has been driven through the House with cyclonic speed after 40 minutes debate, 20 minutes for the minority and 20 minutes for the majority. I have demanded a roll call but have been unable to get attention of the chair. Others have done the same, notably Congress member, Congressman Sinclair of North Dakota, Congressman Bill Lennett of North Dakota, as well as some of the other farmers, labor members. 15 men were standing up demanding a roll call, but that number is not sufficient. We therefore have a spectacle in the great House of Representatives of the United States of America passing after 40 minute debate, a bill its members never read and never saw, a bill whose author is unknown. The great majority of the members have been unable to get a minute's time to discuss this bill. We have been refused a roll call and we have been refused recognition by the chair. Now, ladies and gentlemen, what you all don't understand, they just said that the act was unconstitutional. Go ahead and look up the legislative process for the United States and find out whether or not Congress gets to pass a bill, put it through the House and the Senate <laughs> without there being an author, without it being sponsored by a member of Congress. See, they said they don't even know who wrote the bill. See, it can't be written by anybody else other than a member of Congress. They have to put their signature on it. It's called the legislative process. They just said it was done without normal constitutional processes. That's what the, uh, what you call it, determined. Hold on. I got to do this because she's about to end the song, and I, she's talking about falling in love with me. So we're going to let her fall, but we're not going to let her fall too much, ladies and gentlemen. Hold on. Because that's the last song. She's taking us out of here, but I got to show this to you guys because we can't go any further. These proclamations, thank you, Selena. Ladies and gentlemen, these proclamations give forth force to 470 provisions of federal law. These hundreds of statutes delegate to the president extraordinary powers, ordinarily exercised by Congress, which affect the lives of American citizens in a host of all-encompassing manners. The petition you just saw me produce. This vast range of powers taken together confer enough authority to rule this country without normal constitutional process. Who says this? This is the Senate Committee. Emergency power statutes. Provision of federal law now in effect delegating to the executive extraordinary authority in a time of national emergency report of the special committee on the termination of National Emergency United States Senate, November 19, 1973. Ladies and gentlemen, they affected your rights. That's what that document is for.
Now, if you find somebody else who has done more for you than I have, go ahead and follow that mother. Go with them. You don't need me. But the entitlement of these ignorant morons, and I'm going to say it exactly that way, these people who are contacting me ask, thinking that I'm supposed to sit up there and pull wine from a rock. Well, I've been to Iraq and they got wine. You, all you got to do is, no, you can order it on Amazon from Iraq. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, life has never worked that way. My job was to provide and give people more than what they gave me. So, we'll saw. I can't deal with the ignorance of people. I can't deal with your attitudes. I can't deal with your entitlement. That junk is too irritating. It's too many hours of doing this. And then the fact that we got people that don't listen. I tell you guys, the number one thing I say, don't. I, I said it before the video even started. Keep your stupid comments about my health to yourself. I said that. And the first thing somebody wants to do is act like they can do whatever they want. No, 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 but my intentions were good. Oh, Lord, please don't let me be misunderstood. I don't give up about your intentions. When I say no, I mean no. I could give up about your intentions. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said, entitled people, thinking they got the right to do whatever they want when it comes to somebody else's business. Stay up out of my business. I didn't ask you to get in my business. If I said it at the beginning, if I mention it, take it with a grain of salt. But apparently somebody wanted to take the grain of salt, add vegetables and minerals and pour in a little bit of sauce and add some rice and some chicken and they wanted to make a meal out of it. So that person gets blocked. Any other emails get blocked. And then I'll block them from even contacting any one of the organizations. I have no problem with stuff like that. Because it borders on harassment when I say no. I say, do not, do not trespass. Say, Ladies and gentlemen, do you guys not get this document? Oh, no, that's the wrong document. I got to open it again. I was apologize. Hurry up, mouse, because I got to go. I got a meeting uh, this evening, the company meeting, and then I got to get to. See, look at that. You see, that's, that's, give me a second. Let me put y'all on pause. Oh, now it wants to act right. See, that, that's all I have to do. Make it think I'm about to do something other than what I'm going to do. <sighs> again. It's the AI system that does that. So hold on, y'all. I want to show y'all something because some of y'all ain't getting it. I do not commit consent. Excuse me. I apologize. Like I said, I'm tired. I do not consent to submitting to the court's jurisdiction underneath the consent. It ain't supposed to say underneath. <sighs> That's ChatGPT. Okay, I got to correct that. So y'all hold on. I apologize, uh, ladies and gentlemen. I also had to go stir a pot. <laughs> Peace first pot kicked <laughs> in all the other stuff anyway. I do not can let's let's let the machine read it because I like I said, I am tired. It's been a long day putting this stuff together takes a lot of energy, people. I have to outthink them. I have to think about what they're going to say. I have to anticipate they're going to say this, anticipate they're going to say that. I have to kill their presumptions. That's what this stuff does, people. I know some of you guys are going to add to it because you think you can add this case and that case and that law and this law. Lord have mercy. You don't need to add nothing. I'm killing presumptions. Adding that other stuff, you create more presumptions. Never mind. I do not consent to submitting to the court's jurisdiction, nor do I need to consent. I do not consent to the use of my name, likeness, or any other intellectual, tangible and slash or intangible property, for commercial and or any other use by the court, the defendant, or any other person and slash or entity and slash or branch and slash or organization and slash or company and or fiction under any circumstances, do not trespass, private property, stay off, keep away, notification. In the small claims court of record. In Ladies and gentlemen, do not trespass. Stay off my, get, stay off my property. This is mine. My name belongs to me. You ain't got no right to use my name. That's what you're telling the court. I gave you permission to use my name for other than what I specified. 
you don't get to take my name and do whatever you want to. You don't get to take my estate. I am the captain of this ship. That's what you're saying. Hey, got to go. That's 15 minutes of my time. Now your time. This will be up shortly. Got to go.